Safety is an important factor when it comes to choosing a place to live or visit. If you plan to move to a new place, you will want to know just how safe the area is. Unfortunately, some cities in the United States have higher crime rates than others, making them more dangerous for people who live or visit them. Moving to America, you will want to make sure that you are not relocating to one of the cities with the highest crime wave. Hello and welcome to our channel. In this video, we give you the 10 most dangerous countries to live in the United States of America. Show your support by liking this video and subscribing to our channel. Seat back as we walk you through these dangerous cities in the United States. If you want to feel safe at home, here are some of the worst cities in the USA to live in. Number 10 on our list is Chicago, Illinois. Chicago, the windy city is renowned for its deep dish pizza, architecture, and vibrant art scenes. However, certain neighborhoods have been hotspots for gang violence and shootings, casting a shadow over the city's many positives. The city is popularly known in the United States for being one of the most dangerous cities as it makes the news often due to the dangerous and violent activities that take place there. The population in this city is estimated at 2,746,388 inhabitants, with a crime rate of 3,926 per 100,000 people, making it 67% more dangerous than the United States average. The crime rate in this city is quite alarming with statistics of 2020 showing a figure of 26,620 violent crimes, including 774 murders. Most of these violent crimes are attributed to gang violence and conflict often tied to the drug trade. Coming in at number 9 is Stockton, located in California's Central Valley. Stockton has a crime rate of 4,259 per 100,000 people out of a population of 322,120 people, making Stockton 82% more dangerous than the United States national average. Statistics from 2022 show that the chances of becoming the victim of violent crimes was 1 in 79, with 4,047 incidents out of which were 56 murders, 2 883 assaults, and 918 robberies. In 2023, the city reported 146 homicides and 1,415 violent crimes per 100,000 residents. Next on our list at number 8, is Lubbock, Texas. Lubbock, Texas is another one of the most dangerous cities in the U.S. The city has a population of 260,000 people with a crime rate of 121% higher than the national average. Lubbock, Texas, 263 crimes per 100,000 people in 2022 with 2,856 crimes of which were 431 murders, 2,856 violent crimes, and 28 murders. The overall chances of becoming the victim of a violent crime were 1 in 90. There also happened to be 13,858 incidents of property crime. Moving on to number 7, we have Detroit, Michigan. Detroit is one of the most dangerous cities in the United States. This city is known for its high crime rates, making it one of the deadliest cities in the U.S. With a population of 632,464 people, this city has 5,389 crimes per 100,000 people. This makes the crime rate to be 130% higher when compared to the national average. The chances of being a victim of a violent crime are as low as 1 in 44. In 2022, violent crimes were at 14,430 crimes reported out of which were 330 murder cases, 1,850 counts of robbery, and 11,565 counts of assault. Property crimes were also as high as 21,258 crimes that same year. The sixth most dangerous place to live in the United States on our list is New Orleans, Louisiana. With a population of 376,971 people, New Orleans has a crime rate of 5,864 per 100,000 people making the city 150% higher than the national average. Statistics from 2020 show several 5,221 violent crimes in this city with a chance of becoming a victim to these crimes being 1 in 74. These crimes were made up of 201 murders, 1,106 robberies, and 3,200 assault counts. Property crime counts were also as high as 18,098 that same year. 
This property crime count includes 2,039 counts of burglary and 3,526 counts of vehicular assault. I don't have my driver's license on me. You don't have it on you? Okay. Do you have any Breaking into the top five, we have Baltimore, Maryland. This list cannot be complete without Baltimore as it is also one of the most dangerous cities in America, with a particularly high violent crime rate. With a population of 567,498 people Baltimore has a violent crime rate of 6,170 per 100,000 people. There were 9,532 incidents of violent crime with 18,370 incidents of property crime as of 2020. This crime count made the overall chance of becoming a victim 1 in 17. Violent crimes in 2022 were 177 homicides during the first six months of the year. The majority of these violent crimes in this city are gang and drug related. Now at number 4, we have Albuquerque in New Mexico. Albuquerque is the largest city in New Mexico, known for its rich cultural heritage and stunning natural landscapes. However, Albuquerque is by far one of the worst cities in the whole of America grappling with high crime rates. Living in the city is the same as living amid danger. It has a population of 562,599 people and a violent crime rate of 6,356 per 100,000 people making it 171% more dangerous than the national average. As of 2022, there were 7,552 violent crimes including a record of 80 murder counts, 1,439 robbery incidents, and 5,592 assaults. The chances of becoming a victim of violent crimes in this city are as low as 1 in 75. Albuquerque is also very notorious for the high level of property crime in the city. In 2022, there were 5,075 burglaries, 18,131 incidents of theft, and 4,965 incidents of vehicle theft. This city is undoubtedly worthy to be on this list. Climbing up to number 3, we find Oakland in California. Oakland is a city that boasts of rich tapestry of cultures, art scenes, and beautiful landscapes. However, certain areas of the city have been grappling with crime, particularly robberies and gang-related incidents. Oakland consistently ranks as one of the most dangerous cities in California and America as a whole. Oakland has very notorious neighborhoods which are North Stonehurst, South Stonehurst, Caballo Hills, and South Prescott. These neighborhoods contribute greatly to the high crime rate in Oakland. With a population of 433,823, this city has a crime rate of 6,459 per 100,000 people, making Oakland 150% higher than California and 175% higher than the United States national average. There were 5,714 violent incidents in 2022 alone, including 103 murders, 2,515 robberies, and 2,730 assaults most of which can be attributed to gang violence and drug-related crimes. And now we approach the most dangerous city in the whole of the United States. The second most dangerous city to live in the United States of America is none other than St. Louis, Missouri. This city, with a population of 239,210, this city has a notoriously high crime rate of 234% higher than the national average. That is a pretty high crime rate if you ask me. St. Louis has 7,847 crimes per 100,000 people, with a high number of violent crimes. This makes the overall chance of being a victim of violent crimes in this city to be 1 inch 50. In 2020, violent crimes in the city were up to 6,107 as well as 17,399 property crimes. Out of the violent crimes in 2020, there were 263 murder counts, 1,242 incidents of robbery, and 4, 278 assaults. St. Louis is considered dangerous because of certain neighborhoods which are considered to be the most dangerous in the city. These neighborhoods include Peabody Darst Webby, Hamilton Heights, Walnut Park West, and College Hill. Finally, at the top spot, we have Memphis in Tennessee. Memphis is the most dangerous city in the United States of America. 
The city has a population of 628,127 people and a crime rate of 237% higher than the national average. This city is loaded with violent crimes. Memphis has 7,913 crimes per 100,000 people, with a shockingly high violent crime rate. This city had 15,318 incidents of violent crime, with 289 counts and murder, 2,134 robbery incidents and 12, 484 incidents of assault. Memphis being number one on the list is due to the influence of certain neighborhoods in it. These neighborhoods include Shelby Forest Fraser, Downtown, Parkway Village Oak Haven, and White Haven Coral Lake. These cities make this list because of their high crime rates and the level of danger posed to residents and tourists. So, if you are looking for a safe city to live in the USA, you might want to stay away from these 10 cities. We have come to the end of this video. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and turn on your notification bell for more updates. Thanks for watching.